We welcome V U T Uniform Oscar Mike, Dr. J S T V L from Chennai, and he is going to talk on D X into C Q C Q C Q. Dr. T J S T V L V U T Uniform Oscar Mike is assistant professor at Department of Journalism and Communication, University of Madras, Chepauk, in Tamil Nadu. Uh, the, uh, the new hams doesn't, doesn't know, know what, what is happening, happening in, in the international, international bank. bank. Even, Even some, some of the old hams also, also don't know the DX program, program from around, around the world. The, the lecture will focus on world of radio like webcam, DX party, etc. The focus of the presentation will be how the, the DX thing helps to the, to the ham for, for their, their activities, activities for long distance catches. catches. The, program the program is brought to you live on, on YouTube, YouTube live by V3 Oscar Uniform Mike Coleman Mangesh. The signature tune that you have heard on accordion is by our old man Nandu, V2 November Delta Fox Trot. So, so it is all efforts and, and a teamwork team of Pune Hams which, which is bringing you this excellent program. program. Without, Without spending much time, I will, I will request Dr. Dr. Jai Shaktiwal to start, start his presentation. presentation. Thank, Thank you all for participation. participation. Okay, I think uh, this is... Uh, 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 Mangesh, are you going to give any introduction or I will go on? Okay, thank you. And this is a very interesting session. Okay, okay, I think, think uh, uh, this is a wonderful opportunity that we will uh, enter into this. Uh, Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh. Okay. 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 I, I want. Uh, uh. Uh -huh. Okay. 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 Now I think. Um. Uh, I read my, my uh, uh, volume, volume by there and the recording. Uh, uh, also, I will put in that. Uh, uh, I will transmit in the recording or only in that YouTube only. No. So. Okay. 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 Then no problem. Okay. Thank you very much for the wonderful opportunity for the Pune Hans and. Um, uh, uh, I must to thank to the uh, uh, Dr. Uniform Number Two VP, uh, Mr. Vilas uh, Babeswar, and Dr. Uniform, uniform Number Three UEL Dilip Bhatt, and Victor Uniform Number Three UM Mangesh. All uh, the hand, Pune hands and the people those behind this particular. Um, uh, work uh, for the last uh, few months. We are doing a great job. And thank you very much for the opportunity to talk on the uh, DX into CQ, CQ, CQ. Of course, it is a uh, very uh, interesting topic for the people, those who are in this band and also the SWLs, because a lot of SWLs were entered into this band through this way that uh, I, what I did. So uh, the slide which I saw here is a very important slide and uh, my guru were also there. I think F40 were also on there. Um, thank you very much for uh, this particular team that is BCBXNet 7075 uh, plus or minus I think 707, uh, uh, 7080 uh, on uh, some days. Uh, this is the uh, band which gives me a lot of information about that, what happening there in that uh, international band. 
when i enter into this uh, uh, hobby i monitor uh, my uh, shortwave radio when i tune the shortwave radio i listen a lot of interesting frequencies details were available uh, they told on that uh, particular frequency and i note it down and i enter into this particular uh, international band after that what happened uh, i came to know that one of the very interesting program which were broadcast by voice of america the name of the program called uh, Uh, communication world still it is available in the internet but not in app uh, the program was produced by kim earlier kim andrew earlier he is the person who present the program and produced the program he gave a lot of interesting information about uh, what uh, happening there in the international band and how to tune that one and in which way that it will be helped to you to develop your skills and uh, simultaneously um, they uh, told about this particular program called media network Uh, and this is the person who uh, produced the program uh, his name is called uh, jonathan marks and uh, uh, diana jones i think uh, both of them were presenting a wonderful program and this particular program gave a lot of materials to the uh, dxs uh, like uh, uh, how to uh, catch the long distance stations and what type of receivers were available in the market every uh, topics were uh, released as an a booklet and uh, they send it to the listeners free of cost and nearly 30 plus booklets were uh, they released and uh, every dxs uh, were want to uh, grab that copy that much of interesting copy that is and uh, that is a, a program were introduced uh, in radio netherlands they broadcast the program in radio netherlands still i remember the frequency 120 150 something like that and the next uh, interesting program uh, which helped me to uh, enter into this field uh, uh, called dx party line it is also an interesting program which gives a lot of uh, technical details particularly antenna oriented details and uh, how to catch that uh, that long distance stations and that were broadcast from hc jb australia now uh, they brought the, uh, they changed the name beyond um, Uh, australia uh, so that uh, the exporty line also now on the program and you may ask me like this you are talking about that past and what about what about uh, the present time uh, dxing of course this is the long running show uh, still it is running on um, band and uh, our indian friends were also indian dx report were also given by uh, purkesta uh, and a uh, lot of uh, wonderful uh, presentation were from different parts of the world still it is on air uh, It's Adventist World Radio program uh, called the Wave Scan. It's uh, one of the oldest program and the long-running DX program, which gives us a lot of information. Every Sunday they are on air in different short-wave frequencies. So the hands, those who are uh, in this um, field, you must uh, go to their website or on air. You must listen this program. It's an interesting program, and they have a wonderful web page also. They put Put all the script on their web page. Uh, of course, I am also uh, uh, receiving a script from them, and I put it in my blog called DXS Guide on Blogspot dot com. It's a very very unique program, and it's this is the current running program. And likewise, another interesting uh, program for uh, DXS and the hands. called world of radio um, every week uh, this guy john hansen from usa uh, were uploading a lot of content uh, uh, in their website and also simultaneously they were in the air in the short wave bands very interesting thing is uh, here in this particular program they gave the unknown signals that means uh, you, you have to identify the signal uh, some of the signals were from far away no so what is the uh, broadcast where they were they were they from or from the universe like that they are uh, discussing that new frequencies and uh, interesting uh, materials were there in that particular program still it is on air and also simultaneously in the online and the very interesting thing is that he uploaded the script in his website in the world of radio you may you may go through that website and get a lot of information through this particular website only i am uh, getting uh, uh, interesting information for my blog and my magazines which i uh, run Uh, for the dxs two magazines which we run i will tell that things in the latter part of this lecture so another very very important thing uh, of course you people were aware of that lot of people who are also regular uh, buyer of this book and uh, i must to thank here 
Mr. Arasu sir from Bangalore. Uh, he is a person who is uh, giving me a lot of uh, uh, old uh, uh, WRT heads. In the meantime, that I have to mention uh, Mr. VU to F40, Shamaga Sundaram. I uh, saw so the first number to watch in his QTH. It's a very, very en uh, good encyclopedia for the uh, DXers and the hands also. Uh, that is the reason that they said that the director of global broadcasting. And uh, of course, uh, Josh Jacob and all the team members who are here in India were giving uh, the Indian details to them. It's a very wonderful book uh, for the DXers, those who are entered into this uh, field. So even though the hands uh, uh, doesn't have this book, they must have one copy with them because uh, it is a good uh, reference for them to what's happening there in international band. Who are on air, who, uh, who are doing what. A uh, lot of things were there, 600 plus pages book, uh, like ARRL handbook. It is a very, very important book which helped me to enter into this uh, great world. Uh, this is another book, I, right now it is not uh, on... Uh, uh, publication that means they were uh, stopped their publication due to the people those who are not um, buy this book and also the short wave band were on uh, decline so what happened uh, this passport to world band radio were uh, 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 went out, but this is a very interesting book which gives which focused only on short wave band, and also they are giving a lot of interesting information about ham bands also and uh, frequency charts and uh, reviews of the new receivers and uh, what are the gadgets or uh, goodies were sent to the uh, short wave listeners. So that uh, this is a very interesting book, a four size book, and. Uh, here, another interesting book called Kling Zinfius uh, Shockwave Frequency Guide. It's a competitive guide for the WRTH. Uh, those who are uh, no WRTH and uh, they were, uh, some of them were not aware of this particular guide, uh, Shockwave Frequency Guide. It's a very interesting book this year, The Secret Cuts of Signals for SDR Fund. Those who are in the uh, software defined radio, you must grab this uh, 24th edition of 2020 Shortwave Frequency Guide. This is the one of the interesting guide which I contribute for uh, uh, 10 years in the uh, of our uh, shortwave frequencies. And these guys were giving uh, very interesting facts about snacking there in that software band. And they are also published another interesting book. And uh, you must, uh, uh, the hands must have this book that is called. Uh, uh, utility radio stations. It's a very, <laughs> very, very useful book. Uh, if you are monitor the international band, then you must uh, have this copy. Uh, uh, he will give all the details of the utility radio stations. We may know about the ham bands or we may know about the short wave bands, international broadcasters, but we don't know anything about uh, utility radios. You must uh, please note it down in that utility uh, keyword and you go through that utility radio stations and uh, uh, you may get uh, interesting frequencies for example air bands and the police frequencies not only police the uh, international space station frequencies and the ship frequencies a lot of things over there weather stations time signals uh, uh, so all the details were there in this uh, book uh, every year he is updating this book uh, from uh, and also he is giving uh, sample pages in his website. If you go to the Klingen Fils, you will get the sample pages, whether it is useful to you or not. So these are all the DX part. That is uh, my lecture where there in the two part. One part is focusing on the DXing, another part is on the CQ, CQ, CQ. So uh, the first part we are uh, going on there. So another interesting uh, magazine, which uh, helped me to... Um, uh, as an editor, I worked in this magazine for 15 years. I gave a, a world news column uh, in this uh, short wave uh, news. Uh, this is the oldest uh, DX magazine from Denmark, Short Wave uh, Club International. Uh, uh, and I wrote a column called World News. And in this particular magazine, uh, they gave interesting uh, facts about uh, which of the stations were sending QSLs and the penance and a lot of goodies for the listeners. And, and interesting columns were also there in this one. Right now, they stopped it. And But uh, this particular magazine available in the net, still he is uh, producing the uh, local radio that is... Uh, 
tropical band survey every year he is doing a tropical band survey and he circulate that one in the uh, net as a free of cost so every ham must go and download that material tropical band survey uh, which is very useful for you to uh, check out that uh, condition of the band and let's come to this uh, interesting magazine uh, monitoring times of so you people were aware of this magazine and also you people were, some of you were also subscribe this magazine so it's uh, that uh, topic itself gives you that the monitoring times uh, monitor the band so uh, this is the another interesting and in this one he also uh, give the tropical dh survey and uh, guide to finding and uh, fixing a lot of uh, new frequencies and public service broadcaster so they are also discussing about that uh, new uh, antenna sites such of antenna sites uh, for example uh, you, you people were aware of that that next war will be that uh, electromagnetic waves an interesting magazine another one is for the hands and also for the dxers it's a spectrum monitor understanding effective uh, radiated power areas like this is the recent issue and this is also focusing on the amateur short wave am fm uh, tv and wifi these, these are all the magazines which we receive because of uh, we are also running a magazine i told you, you know so we send a copy to them and they are all sending uh, uh, exchange copies to us so through that way that we are receiving these copies and uh, some of the sample copies available in their website and unfortunately the subscription rate is little bit high so the people will not uh, buy this book uh, just like that uh so dxs guide another interesting and uh, informative magazine we're from india i don't want to give a more information about uh, this guide because this is the guide which we run from india for last uh, 15 years right now it is available on the blog uh, the blog address is www.dxsguide.blogspot.com uh, this particular guide will give a lot of interesting information you see the content how we uh, focused uh, uh, you know behind this uh, how, what is the reason we start this guide is uh, there is lot of things available in the internet that means uh, in india all over the world but in india you see uh, uh, nearly 1000 120 130 crore population we have but we don't have any radio magazines or a ham magazines in a popular way so that what we design why don't we bring out this magazine and uh, you you may be surprised you know what is the sub, uh, subscription rate for this magazine uh, for uh, a year annual magazine it's only uh, 75 rupees uh, and you will get a copy uh, quarterly and uh, likewise uh, we give a lot of uh, indian oriented contents like uh, community radio ham news and the dx for india indian news kiosal corner dx calendar and drm page digital page world news dx difference such a vlogs like these are the uh, chapters where we cover in this uh, dx as guide and uh, still there are lot of uh, subscribers and the dxers were want uh, this why don't you bring it in the uh, hard copy manner but unfortunately uh, you see the production cost is very low but uh, the distribution cost is very high for a courier we have to spend 50 rupees uh, but the subscription rate itself 75 rupees this is the quarterly magazine in english and this is the tamil magazine international radio we call it sarvadesa vanoli in tamil and uh, 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 this is a monthly magazine which focus all the dxing aspect and also the ham aspect and you see the picture of this particular one uh, the lighthouse beef and uh, arasu sar also there in this one and uh, the picture uh, the, it is a monthly magazine the annual subscription rate for this magazine is 100 rupees for the 12 issues so this is also we run for nearly 15 years this magazine also now available in the mm-hmm. um uh, blog uh, the blog address is sarvadesavanoli.blogspot.com so the time is right now 8:50 we have only 10 minutes more so i will go a uh, little bit uh, faster so in this magazine we uh, give uh, the serials and the dx in details how uh, we are dx uh, were entered into the ham band in which way it will help to us and uh, the technical aspect what are the new receivers were available in the market what are the receivers available here in india and uh, books dx books uh, what type of books were available here in india and what are the books available in all over the world like that kind of thing and i must uh, tell you about this interesting book called radio courier 
uh, another interesting book which is published in german unfortunately but uh, it's like a, our india today a4 size book every month they are uh, giving 120 pages booklet which covering lot of interesting facts about the ham band and uh, dxing uh, so you know one thing that uh, all over the world all the countries were publishing this kind of magazines in colorful way but unfortunately here in india we don't have any magazine for the ham or uh, dx community uh, i think this is the chance for i request the people those who are interested in this field we may start one uh, booklet like this uh, all the developed countries even though they are moving to the new technology they are not uh, give up this kind of magazine still they are publishing in uk us japan germany all the countries so here we have to uh, take on lesson from this one and we must to give this kind of book to the community because future community let's come to the cq 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 i think you people were aware of this wonderful uh, practical wireless magazine uh, which is available in the all the british councils earlier but not uh, now um, it's uh, it, it's gives up to date information for the dxers and also the hands and uh, through this way only i learn a lot of uh, new receivers and new type of antennas and home viewing techniques uh, were there in this one this is uh, the place which we learn uh, new uh, interesting and informative things uh, uh, were, uh, from this book and and uh, these people also published another one interesting book called radio user this is focused only on the dxers dxing perspective that means for the dxers and they gave like i said that the cover picture itself shows that spice and uh, radio what are the spice stations where they are that one and how come we will catch it and in which way that we will get a cure cell from them so this is the another interesting uh, magazine which helped me of course some of the hams here in india were subscribed this one uh, from the a r r l qst it's uh, also one of the guide i think um, uh, uh, this lecture were always uh, focused only on the booklets and the magazines but this is the way that we people enter into this world that means uh, we are the uh, how come uh, we receive the uh, details or uh, broadcasting station details from these kind of magazines and the dx program so now what i am doing that uh, i am getting updates were from this kind of magazines and the website ir or website and from different parts of the uh, uh, world ham radio clubs website so qc is in one of the uh, very very interesting useful magazine unfortunately it is also very uh, high subscription rate for this magazine so we people will not buy just like that but uh, you may trans um, uh, that means you will send your magazine to them they will send another magazine for you like that so this is a tip trick for getting this one this is from the uh, great britain uh, radio society of great britain they are publishing uh, radcom Uh, radio communication magazine uh, and uh, still it is on um, active mode so if you people will go to their website and get a sample copy and if you interested you may buy this one you know uniqueness of this magazine is they are giving some of the ofcom uh, broadcasting list ofcom is like an inb ministry ofcom is an, uh, a controlling body there in uk and uh, uh, they are giving a new stations details uh, like rsl stations rsl means restricted service license like here in um, uh, india uh, like a community radio but a unique part of this rsl is for example if uh, deepavali function deepavali festival were came on the time one month only they give on license uh, uh, the name of the channel called uh, deepavali fm for a ramadan Uh, they will give a license for a one month ramadan fm uh, likewise uh, the uh, local festivals no on the time one month license they give and the people will broadcast in a uh, commercial brand that means band that means in the fm band so the that details were available in the redcom and uh, another magazine for the uh, for uk dx magazine called communication which were published by british dx club uh, that is also giving that uh, ofcom details so we got all the bands which gives me lot of information to develop my skills and the cq of course this is also interesting copy which available in the internet but uh, the subscription rate is a little bit high so people uh, please go through
way and some of the dx magazines which i i'm referring in the front way that so here i will stop i think 2 minutes 4 minutes more um, i have to mention this one of the very interesting qsl which we uh, distribute to the people those who are listening our program called radio world which we are broadcast in all india radio uh, chennai every sunday we gave this program and this is the one of the world smallest qsl card after that uh, puskiasta were also published this kind of card uh, so this is the qsl certificate those who are uh, receiving our program and uh, sending a report to us uh, 10 minutes program which broadcast in all india radio chennai external service of all india radio so the name of the program called radio world uh, but unfortunately the program internal so uh, this is a very interesting book where from japan shockwave club and uh, shockwave dx guide it is available on the internet you may go through it and uh, uh, 50% of the content were in japanese but uh, 50% of the content in the english uh, and here you see yesterday i came to know that the person were from bhubaneswar uh, subrat kumar patil uh, were producing a program inbox uh, in box so it's a very important program and uh, interesting program i don't know uh, how the technology were held to the people those who are in this uh, field uh, so here i will stop my presentation